Hi, welcome to Musa's YouTube channel. Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. With the high feeding costs incurred by farmers globally, finding cheap protein alternatives is a must for farmers if they want to make reasonable profits from poultry farming. Azola and duckweed are the cheapest natural alternatives that boost impressive high protein content ranging from 20 to 45 percent. Any farmer who has successfully grown and fed their chickens with it can positively testify. Despite its numerous benefits, Azora and duckweed have their own limitations. Number one, you need access to free space and water. Being a floating plant, Azora and duckweed can only be grown on a well-prepared pond if you are growing it artificially. If, if you don't have access to any or both of these requirements, don't bother growing Azora and duckweed because they won't even last a day. Number two, you need to mix Azora with other feeds like broken corn or maize brand if you want the chickens to feed on them for much longer times. Since Azora and duckweed are often provided fresh, they contain a higher moisture content than dry corn. This makes the plant closer to what chickens would naturally encounter in the wild environment. It is therefore softer and easier for chickens to digest compared to dry corn. This triggers a stronger feeding response from chickens, making chickens to eat these plants faster and finish them in the shortest time possible. Also, the higher protein concentration may also trigger this feeding response. Number three, you need lots of space to produce at least between 500 kg to one ton of Azora daily if you are a commercial poultry farmer. And the demand and supply is made worse by the chicken's stronger feeding response towards Azora and duckweed. To successfully harvest one ton of Azora daily, you will need an initial biomass of 666.6 kilograms of Azora and duckweed with a pond area covering at least 333.3 square meters. This will double the rate within three days. Number four, heavy harvesting, limited nutrient supply and water quality issues can hinder healthy azora and duckweed growth. These plants thrive on specific nutrients such as nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. 
there are four over harvesting mate deplete the bond of these nutrients and without replenishing essential nutrients back these plants will eventually start to die one by one once the chickens have gotten used to the test of azora there is actually no turning back for them they will consume everything to the last bit therefore if you think you have all it takes to grow azora and duckweed please go ahead you won't regret the decision don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more informative discussions